Guys, I'm OG123, and I just want to say, you are my humble viewers, and that's not what I was going to start it with, but I, everything just got jumbled in my head, because I'm actually really annoyed at the moment. Um, and this is going to be another rant, as you can see by the top, uh, the title sequence thing. Um, I'm really annoyed, because, you know, let's face it, uh, I know Osama Bin Laden is dead, and although that's brilliant, because he's the head of Al-Qaeda, that won't change a bloody thing. And I can't believe that people are so narrow-minded, that and disgusting, and sick, and dubious that they would celebrate the whole America over all the United States celebrated that um, Osama Bin Laden was dead you'd spent so much money so much effort and this is what our society does it spends so much money effort and uh, energy on just finding small groups of things because there's what because they are in front and they're in the media's eye and as long as they're in the media's eye that's what we need to do in fact a million people in America, a million people each year die of coronary heart disease, right? Which can be stopped by simply not eating as much fatty food. Uh, 30,000 people die from um, automobile accidents. And considering the fact that 3,000 people died in 9-11, which was an awful event, no doubt. It was definitely an awful event and should never have happened. But 30,000 people die from automobile accidents each year, which is 10 9-11s each year. And consider this, mosquitoes, the tiny little things that no one even cares about and swats away, have killed more people in the history of the world combined than plague, famine, war, old age, anything else, everything else put together combined, mosquito beats them. The mosquitoes have killed billions of people and billions of things and nobody's worried about them nobody's giving enough money to science so they can come up with more cures and no one's giving enough money to healthcare so that we can treat people so if they've got malaria instead of going oh we spent all our money catching Osama Bin Laden we got him though yeah, but I'm gonna die and <laughs> we don't care we got Osama Bin Laden it's, it's not fair on these people who millions and millions and millions and millions of people in the world who are living in abject poverty because their countries want to control certain tiny little areas and they don't think about the big picture um, uh, you know in England it's the same thing as well with this whole big society that David Cameron is trying to impose the big society doesn't work it doesn't work as a concept it's just it, it basically is uh, saying to us right we'll handle the, the government's just saying we'll handle the things that you care about the rest of it you can get on with we don't want to police that we don't want to have any you know, anything to do with that you guys do that we'll do the stuff that gets you to like us now I'm not saying that Obama said it just to say that you know uh, oh yeah vote for me in the next election and I mean I know his polling rate's been going down but the guy is one of the best presidents they've had in a while so it's not like he's orchestrated this to make sure that his uh, popularity goes up. I just think it's sick that people are celebrating it because there's so much other stuff that that we overlook and our society and our culture is completely messed up and disgusting and sick. Our culture and society and our world is ill. It is ill. And the only way we can push forward is to realise it's ill and go, right, okay, we've been doing wrong for so many years and what can we do in the future? to make sure that our children, our children's children, our children's children's children don't have this problem. So that instead of catching criminals in small little tiny places, we focus on the big picture. Imagine if they put that much energy, money and effort into actually destroying or capturing all the uh, rebels from Al Qaeda. What about if they actually uh, spent that time destroying the Taliban? What if they spent that time doing healthcare or something like that? If you still want the wars, then spend time there instead of trying to impose a threat to a small community of people. And it's not like Al Qaeda's fallen because Osama bin Laden's gone. Hell no, they've had like Osama bin Laden was their leader. It doesn't mean that they haven't got other people to take over. So you know, I think it's sick and disgusting that people are celebrating it, and I think that we should all just sort of look at the society and say we're ill. We need to sort something out. We need to get more out in the open to say this is our problem. We should be dealing with this instead of this. <sighs> okay, I'm good now. Vented. Um, I'll see you guys later. Uh, thank you very much for watching. And if you like my views, um, then keep watching because they're probably more of these. Um, I'll see you guys later. Bye.